A new study called the Happiness Report shows Singaporeans are most unhappy with their personal savings. It also shows what they are happiest with. Take a look. The study, conducted by global communications firm Grey Group, found that nearly half of the 200 respondents reported a lack of sufficient savings in the last six months. They also ranked personal expenditure, confidence in the economy, job satisfaction and work-life balance as areas causing them grief, something the government and companies should take note of. They need to clearly keep in mind that Singaporeans are worried about you know, um, spending. So uh, try not over um, overpower them with lots of offers and trying to influence too much of purchase because that's going to drag them down even more on the unhappy scale. Uh, try and understand where the consumer is at today and help them save. As for the top five things Singaporeans are most happy about, their area of residence topped the index, with about 78% ranking Singapore to be the best in the world. Singaporeans were also most happy about the close family ties, spirituality, social support networks and personal time that they enjoyed. The study also discovered that baby boomers were the happiest, with young adults being the most unhappy. Men were also found to be happier at work. About 46% said they were happy with their jobs, compared with 38% for women. Now, most people I spoke with agreed with the results, citing the rising cost of living as their main source of unhappiness. The rising of the HGV flats, the cost of living, basically that. In schools these days, it's very competitive, so, you know, everyone's competing with each other. We have a little bit more pressure, I think, in terms of having a family and then having to balance that with work. The study designed to monitor national sentiments on issues that impact consumer behaviour was conducted in June this year. And after the break